Hi Scorpio, welcome to your Astro Mojo. I'm your astrologer Lisa Perron with your August 2016 Monthly Stars and Crystal. But before I get to that, I have a special announcement to make. My debut article for Del Horoscope magazine is called Astrology and Crystals, A Match Made in Heaven, and will be featured in the October edition of the Del Horoscope magazine on sale August 23rd on newsstands. So please feel free to pick up a, a copy of the magazine and tell me what you think. Uh, comment on my Facebook page what you think of my article. I'd love to hear from you. I'm very, very excited about it. So, Scorpio. Uh, August, it's looking pretty good. The sun will be in Leo this month, encouraging you to have some fun. Be more romantic and a little more light. Take uh, take some time to maybe go on a little vacation. It'll do you a world of good to get away. This is an excellent time for new romances or to rekindle the flame of an existing relationship or partnership. And August lucky stars for you have the sun occupying your solar 10th house sector of your career, your status in life, your recognition and prestige. This may represent the possibility of new opportunities uh, to advance your career and your status in life. There could be even an award or an honor for a past achievement or hard work you've done. Your ruling planet Mars enters Sagittarius, bringing more fire energy our way on the second. Mars is now building up speed after a long retrograde and will be at maximum velocity by the end of this month. Projects or new starts will grow quicker at this time and people that have been feeling especially drained physically uh, over the last several months to a year will now begin to feel more energetic and lively with a, a little more zest for life than before. Your health will feel better. Uh, the new moon on the second in Leo shines also on your 10th house of career, honors and status in life. And new moons are a wonderful time for a fresh start, a new beginning or a project. And the magic of the new moon, the energy can shine healing light and hope into your life at this time. On the 18th, the full moon lunar eclipse in Aquarius shines her magical energy on your fourth house of home and family. The full moon is a time of completion, bringing healing energy and good fortune to finances and finalizes deals. The lunar eclipse is always a time of change. Uh, it's usually relationships when it's a lunar eclipse. It's a time when the magic can happen and your fondest wishes and dreams could become your new reality. Harness the energy of these stars by carrying a lucky crystal gemstone such as adventuring to attract new opportunities, abundance and improve your mojo. The month of August ends with Mercury going retrograde or in a backward state from August 31st until September 23rd. Mercury retrograde is typically a time when communication is not quite so clear and Murphy's law is in full effect. This is a time when all forms of communication are not quite uh, up to snuff and they can be challenged like uh, emails could be affected not going through, missing phone calls or appointments or showing up on the wrong time or date, uh, travel mix-ups like missing flights, losing luggage, long waits and delays, could be electronic, computer uh, crashes, uh, glitches, uh, electronics not working, mechanics, cars not working properly. Uh, General communication chaos would be the best description of Mercury retrograde, I think, if there were three keywords. You can see my video on Mercury retrograde here on my YouTube channel, uh, if you scroll down for more information on the subject. And make sure to back up your computer and double check all your appointments and your uh, flights before the end of the month, just to make sure. If you're a stargazer or astronomy buff, look up at the night sky between August 10th and 13th for a glimpse of the beautiful Perseid meteor shower. Usually gets underway after midnight into the wee hours of the morning and there could be up to 100 meteors an hour. Cool. Make sure also to watch my 
video, Lunar Eclipse and World Predictions, particularly you'll be interested if you're an American citizen. And also check your August video horoscope forecast with Lucky Crystal for your sun sign, moon sign, and your ascendant for more celestial insight. Thank you so much for watching and subscribing to my videos. Of course, if you, I would love it if you would subscribe to my videos if you have not done so already. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel and help me spread the word. Like, comment my, on my videos, share them on your social media sites. You can visit my website, astromojo.com, for free daily horoscopes, world predictions, which I make regularly, and astrology articles to help you achieve success, as well as give you spiritual guidance. And if you know someone that could use uh, some advice or spiritual guidance, please feel free to share my videos on your social media sites or to send them a link to it. Thank you. This has been a general astrology forecast for August 2016, but these events will only affect you personally if you have planets influenced by these signs degrees. Uh, for personal predictions for yourself, or to see how the stars may affect you or the eclipses, there's two more happening in September. Or if you need guidance with love, uh, career, or a specific issue, I'm always here to help. You can order your in-depth astrology and personal astrology reading with me based on your specific location, date, and time of birth at astromojo.com slash in-depth readings. The best way to handle August energy is to have fun, go with the flow. You never know what's around the next corner. Take a chance on life and love. You never know what's ha going to happen. I'm your astrologer, Lisa Perron, and the stars speak to me. Until next time, lovelies, I wish for you abundance, and I send you my love and light. Take care. So mote it be.